All right, all right, all righty, all right. What's going on, everybody? My name is Pete, but you probably already knew that. But in case you didn't, you guys are watching the one, the only, Paid to Drive, one of the only channels on YouTube, trying to put a little bit more of that money right back in your pocket in so many ways. Shout out to BZ. So, what is going on, all my DoorDash drivers? If you are a DoorDash driver, comment DoorDash driver right now in the Premiere chat in the comments. And if you're watching on the Premiere, comment hashtag Team Premiere. If you're watching on the replay, comment hashtag Team Replay. Please share this video, everybody, for real. And of course, <clears throat> before we jump into this, I got to give some very special thanks to our now 11 patrons on Patreon. We've got Anna Marie, Brian, Dave, Destiny, Drive Gig with Renee, Frank, Jason Keister, Kelly, uh, Kimberly Thomas, Larry, and of course, the one and only Aunt Sherry. I got to give huge thanks to all of them. Please join us if you would like. Always optional, always appreciated. Patreon.com slash paid to drive. Links in the description down below. So I just want to share this email that I received a little while ago. I wasn't going to even put up another video tonight, but <clears throat> this, this had to be said. So let me see here. What's up, everybody, in the chat real quick? Guys, let's get those 150 thumbs up real quick now. Comment 111 if you hit the like. Comment 222 if you can't see the like on your phone or tablet. you got to hit the X in the top right corner. Hit the like and then hit live chat, and you'll be good to go. <coughs> Excuse me. So listen to this, and I want to know if you guys can relate. Hey, Pete, I know you've been getting a lot of messages and emails lately, and I don't mean to overwhelm you, but I just needed to write this. After today's DoorDash disaster with the app crashing, it has really put a bad taste in my mouth working for this company. Now, let me just pause real quick. Comment 333 in the chat or in the comments if you work today on DoorDash and it crashed for you. 333 for yes, 444 for no. Just curious, guys. I'm really thinking of deleting the app and retiring from working with DoorDash altogether and just focusing on other apps at this time. It's time to quit. DoorDash has been good to me in the past, but as of late, it's becoming unbearable for me. As far as the other apps are concerned, I'll more than likely keep working on Uber Eats and Grubhub with some Postmates if I really need extra orders. I'm just curious, do we have any Postmates drivers here? Comment Postmates in the chat or the comments real quick. It's just a shame that DoorDash, being as big of a company as you mentioned in today's earlier video, can't get it together and provide an app that is reliable for all drivers. I agree wholeheartedly with this, everybody, with what he's saying here, because let's face it, it's it's a real problem. You know, it's an app, you know, it's essentially you're going to work and when you get to work, you know, like for instance, the, uh, the, the clock in thing is not working. So you don't know if you're going to get paid for the day. It's just like, you know, it's, uh, it's always an uncertainty and in uncertain times, this makes it that much worse in my opinion. Uh, let's see here. <clears throat> uh, it's just a shame that DoorDash being as big of a company as you mentioned in today's earlier video, can't get it together and provide an app that is reliable for all drivers. Yes. I'm wondering if any of your other viewers are feeling the same way that I am. I can't be the only one here. Thank you for your content. I've always enjoyed it. If you read this on the air, please only say my first name. Thanks, Pete. Uh, and his name is Francis. So everyone say thank you to Francis. Um, so with that being said, everybody, sorry, my allergies are killing me over here. So I keep uh, rubbing my nose here. Sorry. Let me just, let me get my bearings straight here. Okay. Let me just adjust myself. Are you guys all with me? If you're still with me, say we're with you, Pete. Oh, we're with you. Oh, it's true. It's damn true. Anybody know that reference? Put that in the comments or the chat. And of course, guys, you know the deal. We're not looking too good with the likes down there. We could totally do a little bit better than that. Smash that like. Crush that like. Comment 111 if you did. 222 if you didn't yet. Uh, close the chat in the top right corner on your phone or tablet. Hit the like and then hit live chat to the right and you'll be good to go. So anyway... Um, going back to what Francis is saying here, I, I don't blame him for feeling that way. Should he throw in the towel? That's up to him. Again, that's totally up to him. 
Uh, it's not like he's being fired, but if he wants to quit, you know, or whatever you want to refer to it as, retire, as, as was his words, um, that's his prerogative. Um, I, I think during these times we should try and still keep doing DoorDash, you know, as just as a last resort. Um, because it seems that it's been the busiest. Now, let's just do a quick poll in the chat, in the comments. What has been the busiest app for you currently in the past 30 days? Has it been DoorDash? Has it been Grubhub? Has it been Uber Eats? Has it been Postmates? What has it been? Which one? Put it in the comments. Put it in the chat real quick. And Pete, in the future, comment something right here in the chat, right here down below. Just so I know you're there, just say, Pete from the past. I'm here from the future, something like that. You know, it's always fun. You gotta, you gotta have some laughs these days, everybody, because people are going stir crazy. I'm actually not. I feel like I'm more at peace. You know, not having to worry about going out and doing crazy things. Because let me tell you something. The thing in life that we all really need to worry about is our blood pressure and stress. Stress is bad, very, very bad. It's a silent killer. Okay, and anybody who tells you differently is lying to you because it's true. Stress lowers your immune system, which can make you more susceptible to catching this thing that's going around. Okay, that's something that we all need to keep in mind. Um, but like in regards to what Francis is saying, I don't think he should quit. I don't think he should quit. If he wants to take, you know, a couple of days off, give it a week or so, or maybe just not work on a Friday because it seems that Friday is the day that DoorDash crashes. DoorDash crashes in a young mother grass. Anybody know that one? What's that reference? Lynn Lucas. You should know it, my music buddy. Let's see who the first person is to guess that, that what that parody is in the chat or in the comments. On the count of three, one, two, three. Go. There you go, everybody. Did you guys all check out my vlog yet today on PTD Vlogs? Comment 555 if you did, 665 if you didn't. And of course, everybody, we're not done with the video yet, but make sure all of you are saving money with the Get Upside Gas app. Comment 333 in the chat if you are signed up on there already. Comment 444 if you are not yet. Um, of course, links are in the description. All you have to do is download the free app. Uh, from the description down below, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt when you're done pumping gas with the Get Upside Gas app on your smartphone, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description down below. The video is not done yet, guys. I just wanted to get that out there right now for those of you. Because every time they everyone hears that, they're like, oh, the video's over. So I'm throwing you a little curveball. Just wanted to get that out of the way. So going back to Francis's email, <clears throat> what do you guys think? Do you think that Francis is right in feeling that he should quit? Do, let, let's do a poll. Comment 333 if you think... Francis should call it quits. Comment 444 if you think he shouldn't. And of course, guys, let's get those 150 thumbs up. The likes are not doing too great down there. Comment 111 if you hit the like, 222 if you haven't done that yet. So I'm going to wrap this up saying this. <clears throat> Francis or anybody who is thinking about quitting DoorDash because of them crashing constantly, because I know there were, a lot of people were having horror stories. I've been getting the messages for the past couple of hours, and people have been telling me, that they got stuck with deliveries, they couldn't mark them delivered, customers were getting upset, there were phone calls going around and text messages, and it was just a big mess. I get it. But right now, we all need to be very lucky and grateful we still have these apps. I'm not defending DoorDash. They should have a reliable app. This is not acceptable. But what I'll tell you right now is they need to have something working. Okay? They got to work on that server capacity, man, because this is going to just keep being an ongoing problem. You know, I know Tony Shu does not want this to continue, all right? I could only imagine. It would be a horror story. If I was a business owner and my app was crashing like this, I'd be freaking out. I'd be, I'd be asking my engineers, what the hell is going on? What the hell is going on over here, guys? Come on. Anyway, that's all I got to say. Send me your emails, curses or praises, right? Pay to drive stories at gmail.com. Maybe some of the mods or Pete from the future can put that in the chat real quick and of course huge shout out to our new patrons we have 11 new patrons on our exclusive social media patreon okay sign up today guys 
Always optional, always appreciated. But of course, Kimberly Thomas, Dave Chin, Drive Gig with Renee, Anna Marie, Destiny Rudolph, Brian, Frank, Jason, Sherry Cassidy, Kelly Sego, and Larry Fritzum. Who's going to be number 12? Links in the description down below. Go give it a look if you want. And that's all I got for you, everybody. Patreon.com slash pay to drive. I'm going to be on there later on tonight talking with all of you. So it is what it is, guys. Take care of yourselves. Let me know if you're out there working. Let me know if you're home. But if you can, stay home, save lives, and help stop the spread. Smash the heck out of that like. Subscribe down below with the notifications on. We're almost at 19,000 subs. And I'll see you guys next time right here on Paid to Drive YouTube channel. Love you, Michelle Cesare. Go subscribe to her, too. Peace, everybody. Be excellent to each other and share this video and watch some other videos on the screen and all that stuff. And we'll see you next time. Peace.